happy Saturday. Hey guys. <laughs> uh, coffee time with Jay and Krista. Say I do forever. It's us. And it is an early, it's about 6.30 a.m. on a Saturday morning yep. um, of Memorial Day weekend. So it's raining. It's raining. <laughs> <laughs> Again, we've had oh, wow. probably about a week and a half of rain. Yep. Which is great for the plants and great for my vegetable garden. <laughs> but it's not great for having fun in the yard because you can't go out there. Yeah. But two weeks ago, I shot some video of our yard. It was Mother's Day weekend, the Saturday before Mother's Day weekend. Um, we didn't do a lot of videoing, uh, mainly because we're in a really hard season of our lives right now uh, with my mom passing away. Um, and we were having to deal with Mother's Day weekend, which was a really hard weekend. <clears throat> and we just needed some garden therapy, and I think garden therapy is our favorite thing. So That's our go-to, yeah. Uh, when we've done some gardening, we've just gotten out there to get a little therapy. Yeah. But I did shoot a little bit of video, um, but then it just rained, and we never got the time to sit down and do um, kind of a beginning and an end. I just had random clips, so I want to show those at the end of this video. But I thought before we start our day, and we have some exciting news of what's going to happen in the next video, because it's happening this morning, um, we'll tell you about that in a minute. I wanted to talk about uh, the fact that we haven't been here. Um, we've been, uh, haven't done a coffee time in a really long time. Yeah, there's been a lot going on. So <clears throat> as far as my work, I went back to where I work, and uh, they promoted me to warehouse manager, so... Now I'm back to being a warehouse manager, so that's, that's very time consuming. Um, so we didn't have a lot of time there, you know, as far as here at home, uh, mm -hmm. plus the rain, plus she's been sewing like crazy. So we've got that and then family um, trying to, you know, make sure everyone that's older than us is taken care of. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we, yeah, just a lot. We hit... We've made it through, now this weekend will be four of the big firsts of my mom's death. Yeah. And that first one was Easter, just trying to survive, uh, you know, a week after pretty much of my mom uh, passing or her funeral. Yeah. And we went right into Easter and trying to make sure my dad was taking care of my sister, stayed here for uh, two months. And she actually yeah. left at 5.30 a.m. this morning to head back to Louisiana. So say a prayer for her and her travels in the next couple days. And yeah. um, I just was so grateful to have her here. Um, she stayed with my dad and and um, and just they had a, a great time together. And, and I, we couldn't have done these first. I mean, we had Easter, and then we had Mother's Day. And last night was, or yesterday was my dad's birthday. Um, really hard to have, you know, his first birthday without my mom. Yeah. And uh, then it's Memorial Day. And this Monday, actually Memorial Day, is the two-month anniversary of my mom passing. Um, so we went out to the grave. Um, I'll probably uh, capture some of that and put it in one of the videos this weekend. Um, as well. So stay tuned. I'm going to make lots of little videos. Um, but we have an exciting one this morning. Yeah. It's happening yeah. this morning. So I'm going to try to capture some video footage. Yeah. So a friend of mine is coming over this morning who's very, very good at anything construction. And he's uh, set um, doors before. So um, he's going to help me with that. And uh, yeah. It's going to be good. A uh, little side note about Krista's mom is she's from a line of American Revolution. Uh, the Daughters of the, the American Revolution, yeah. yeah um, so her relatives back in the day fought mm -hmm. in the American Revolution against, against the British. So mm -hmm. anyway, so that's kind of a special deal too because it's you know, Memorial Day, and it's remembering those mm -hmm. who, who died for the freedoms yeah. that we have now today. So anyway. Yeah, it's just uh, everything about my mom's passing has been so interesting. 
that her funeral uh, started on, um, well, the night before uh, when Passover began was her viewing, and the next day was the first full day of Passover, and that was her funeral, um, and that had special meaning to us. Um, and then also that, you know, her two-month anniversary of her passing is on Memorial Day, um, and my dad actually had her buried at um, a, a, in an area that has all the veterans, because my dad is a veteran, um, and it has all the these fl American flags. My mom was so patriotic. Oh, yeah. We actually 100% patriotic. Had her, uh, buried in her DAR vest with all of her her medals. The Daughters of the American Revolution. Yeah. Um, outfit, yeah. All red, white, and blue, just like she would like. Yep. And um, and so I just think it's so funny. And and yesterday my sister and I went out. Uh, I'll put that in a video and put uh, flags on her grave. We put a big flag for my dad and four little flags for my siblings. Uh, and then we put some pinwheels out for the grandkids. So Yeah, her mom, Krista's mom, was all about pinwheels. She loved pinwheels. So it is so fitting that they put <laughs> pinwheels for And their American grand... flag pinwheels. Yeah, the red, white, and blue. <laughs> when they spin, it's cool. Anyways, lots of uh, stuff going on. Yeah. But so glad to have coffee again with you guys yeah, and for sure. um, we've missed you we've missed doing this um just life is a little hard yeah. right now but <laughs> and we've got a lot more stuff planned in the yard if we could ever get past the uh cat ruining the chair and uh get past <laughs> the rain um but yeah anyway oh and the shirt i'm wearing is a one oh. of my my stepsister got me it and I was talking to her about it and so she went and got me one but it says I'm just one big freaking ray of sunshine <laughs> and, and I was uh, just noticing my my uh, coffee mug actually matches, matches you. The, maybe I should have drank out of that one today <laughs> you need your matching yeah anyways but yeah she bought that for you yeah she's she's pretty cool yeah but anyway um, we're gonna try to post more often we're sorry that we haven't been posting you know mm -hmm. as often as we used to but, you know, sometimes life itself gets in the way and we don't have the time to grab the camera and set everything up and, and do all that. So we apologize for that. But mm -hmm. we're very grateful for all 500 plus of you guys uh, that are following us and uh, going along this journey with us. And mm -hmm. so we can share our life experiences as a married couple with you guys. Yeah. So um, we're having a lot we're, of fun. Yeah. And uh, we hope you guys are laughing with us, at us. <laughs> you know whatever um, yeah. and enjoying it too yeah there's some really cool videos coming up uh, some surprises uh, Jay got a permit uh, to do something in the South Hills from the forestry service yeah yep. that'll be fun pretty exciting so there's a lot of fun stuff so hang on with us that one you'll get yeah. a kick out of <laughs> so yeah just uh, hang on because we're gonna have some good stuff coming up and uh, in this video right here I'm gonna show you right now the clips um, for that we did What's on Mother's on? Day weekend, yeah. and then I think today it is raining right now. But if I can get a break in the rain, I'm going to go out uh, and video the yard now. So you'll see the difference between two weeks ago and now. And then if you go back to our video that was kind of a garden tour, uh, end of April, I think. Um, you're gonna see what a huge difference our yard. It's just yeah. come leaps and bounds. It's amazing. It like we got a couple eighty degree days and everything went boom. Well, and our grasses <laughs> completely come around. I, I know we had one comment. It's like, well, it's beautiful, but your yard's dead. <laughs> it's like or patchy or whatever. No, it was dead. Yeah. It, yeah, and now it's like green. Yeah. It's like really green, green. Yeah, it wasn't dead. It was sleeping. Yeah. Well, it, it, it's awake now. It's awake now. <laughs> and we got green grass. So. Yeah, so much so. I'll show you out there. Um, yeah. Jay mowed it yesterday, and it was so moist from growing so thick from all the rain that his shoes were solid green. Yeah. And it's like wearing slippers <laughs> about that thick underneath the, uh, yeah. the shoe. I'll have to show where you came, yeah. came off of the... Onto the oh cement. yeah it was like ridiculous <laughs> yeah so let's go ahead and play this video um, of all of the last couple weeks <laughs> just the little bits and uh, 
And then thank you so much again for joining us. <laughs> and go ahead and sign us out. Okay. Jay Christus, see you forever. And uh, hope you enjoy this. Love you guys. We'll see you at the end. Have a great weekend. Oh, she's oh, on the wow. table. That's a cat that's not supposed to be on the table. <laughs> Love you guys. See you guys. <laughs> Hey, lady. <laughs> okay, so a lot has changed over here. We didn't get video while we were changing it just because it's Jay's birthday, Mother's Day. But this used to be where we kept the lawnmower. We kept everything junky. It was all weeds. It was so bad. And Jay finished the fence and then he finished staining. Um, and then he got all the weeds done or out of there and uh, as you can see he's put down uh, he leveled it too uh, so it would drain to the middle and then out the fence and he put down um, cardboard so the weeds would um, at be out it sounds like he's right behind me <laughs> <laughs> I got more pea gravel for you <laughs> Okay, you're going to have to back up and let me out. <laughs> I can back this bus up. Anyway, tell me, uh, like this weekend we were kind of, it was a race against... The weather. The weather. Um, so we got out here really early before, knowing that it could storm at any time. Yep. Um, and then you've been working on it. Plus it was your birthday weekend, wanted to just and do Mother's your Day. thing. And Mother's Day. Yeah, and, and Krista's wanted to do this side of the yard for like seven years. So <laughs> yeah. I thought to myself... What better time than the present to get it done? And so now we're getting after it. Yep. And then you're going to build me a workbench, or I, not a workbench. A uh, potting bench. Yeah, I yeah, will as be. As soon as we get all this done, then I'll start in on the potting bench. We still got to paint the rest of our house. So There's yeah. There's a lot going on. This is going to be a busy okay, summer. Okay, let me get out of your way. Sure. <laughs> it's going to be a busy summer. I'm going to take them on a tour of the yard because okay. just a month ago, you wouldn't even believe how much has been popping up. Um, we still don't have the pond uh, cleaned out, the stream cleaned out. You know, it just is what it is. We're going as fast as we can. It's like we went straight from winter to summer and then now we're kind of in this weird thing of rain and wind. So he, we're working on it, but this, uh, the stream, oh, hi, sweetie pie this stream and all of that needs uh, some help. But that doesn't stop the squirrels from loving it. Huh. Hi, sweetie pie. Okay. And all of this in my last video, there was absolutely nothing here. And um, this is what you call like snow on the mountain, or you can call it um, you can call it, I think they call it bishop's weed. I don't know the technical term, but this has come up everywhere. And I think she really, really needs a peanut. Let me, I hope I have one. And then um, in this barrel in the back or the big uh, pot, I have planted uh, my elephant ears. And there's a bunch of pots on the... Um, on the deck that I have actually um, potted all of those kind of clustered they all have elephant ears in them which when then when they pop up I've got to find uh, I've got to find spots for them that are in, more in the shade but right now I'm just trying to get them going um, I think we might have had our last frost but look at all of the stuff popping up right now and all the bushes starting to um, get their leaves. Our raspberries in the last video that we dug up, they're still hanging in there, probably because we had so much rain. 
and uh, all kinds of really great uh, bulbs and such. And then this is the next project, it's so bad, because we took everything from that other side and we've been cleaning it out. My potager is just filled with pots and um, tomato cages, all of that kind of stuff. We are at the point where I can soon, this next couple weeks, I can actually plant out my vegetable garden. So this is our next project. But the Christmas tree is gone. Yay! <laughs> so um, I think we've come really far. The grass is much greener. I think my last little tour I did, the grass was um, <laughs> so brown. And we even had a comment about how ugly our grass was. Um, but it is what it is. Cause, but in one month, what a difference. Look at all of the things that have leafed out. Um, just a ton of stuff leafing out. A lot of tulips up. Um, even in my, uh, I think it's Lily of the Valley, like up in there, we've got some uh, more raspberries that need to go to Jay's mom's house. Look at all the new leaves we have on our uh, Japanese maple. <laughs> it's looking good. The Bleeding Heart, the, um, the Grapevine is leaving out. Um, everything is starting to come together. It's looking so good. Hey, let me show, see What's Josh. <laughs> hey, Mr. Josh. How are you guys? Good. You have been working your tail off, not only here, but also at your grandma's house. Yes, ma'am. Because <laughs> you and your grandma have totally torn up their yard. Yeah, family first. <laughs> well, you have proved that to be true. So thank you so much for your hard work. We, yeah, no problem. We couldn't do it without you. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> and we'll have to get a video of um, Amy's yard later yeah. uh, mom and pop huh because yeah, you guys good. did oh my gosh it looks so good yeah it looks good <laughs> yeah and you guys surprised us you did it before we did yeah <laughs> and here comes Jerry with another load Ta -da. looking good and um, we're waiting to spread it out until um, he's gonna do a little pad believe it or not a little garage not a garage but a little pad driveway for the lawnmower right there and um, then he has to put down the rest of the walkway the flagstone um, we finally got my little what is this called <laughs> Uh, raised bed, raised bed uh, yeah. kind of I, I want to get that up in it yep. um, got a blackberry and right now I'm just working on a little uh, little mini flower bed just to put in the blackberry and when the water comes out of here it's just going to go run into the blackberry so lots of little plans can you imagine a little potting bench right there the sitting area back <laughs> maybe maybe a little i don't know maybe i could uh do some pots or something it's a little peace of mind yeah peace of mind back there i mean this is seven years in the making we finally decided you know what we're gonna do it so yeah. now we put the cardboard down first we ripped up all the weeds then put the cardboard down now the pea gravel <clears throat> pea gravel is so cheap here so how much did it cost you 62 bucks for a full yard that's two ginormous scoops with their with their front end loader that's awesome so yeah and it uh, one yard did the complete section that we were going to cover anyway we yeah. still have to even thin it out so we may even haul some of this over into your uh vegetable garden maybe that's awesome <coughs> if we uh or even between the if we have too much the flagstone a little yeah bit we still too. can do that too yep so and the next is to paint this brick oh and you don't know this, but we bought you a new peony huh? for Mother's Day. And uh -huh. 
we got you the ground cover that can be full sun so we can go in between all these bricks these oh, flagstones nice, nice nice so you can walk on it and it won't catch an edge you know between the flagstone pieces nice so, thank you all is well in the world <laughs> yes it is happy mother's day and happy birthday thank you <laughs> happy mother's day double double enjoyable weekend yep it's been fun so far the storm has kind of been hit and miss we've gotten uh blessed with just a little light breeze and clouds but that's mainly it we thought we were going to get hammered with a thunderstorm at one yeah. and it's not one anymore it's 541 so yeah, yeah. yep we yeah. still we did have still like going. that really heavy rain come down all at once but yeah but that was just real brief yeah best part is now we can get after this and get this done well that's awesome well thank it's you exciting. so much i'm getting Heck tired yeah. i, I want to put my feet up what about you nope i gotta finish this <laughs> you never, then i'll put my feet up you never rest nope <laughs> well thank you yeah <laughs> Okay, I thought, even though it's raining today, I would give you a tour of the yard as much as I can out there and probably have to also get under cover. Um, first of all, I want to show you how the grass has filled in in the areas that I patched it. Doesn't that look amazing? I think we have a couple spots. All of these little white seeds are horrible. They have been falling uh, from these trees up here uh, for the last two weeks and they are everywhere. And uh, they kind of drive me crazy because as soon as you clean them up, they're all over the patio. They're all in my pots. Also, um, these pots, I'll be putting them around the yard, but for now I planted um, some of our elephant ears and look what we've got coming up there's one right there there's one right there um, I don't see any in the other pots yet but the yard is really looking good excuse the lawnmower that's out because last night right before the rain Jay mowed and the hose is out but I want to show you the poppies really quickly because last night they were completely closed <laughs> these ones crack me up there I call them the feed me Seymour <laughs> kind of plant and the whole look at how big this bush of them is but this morning I actually came out yesterday they were all just the seed or not the seed pods oh and there's my kitties hi kitties <laughs> they were all um, just ready to bloom but I was waiting and this morning in the rain I come out and they're like half popped I've never seen them half pop like that but let me see that is so, I've never seen them actually do that. So those will open up to be super beautiful. So that means this week, I think, this whole little planting is going to be um, all red. I love that. A little update. We haven't gotten to do any more down here, um, but we will and I did get potted or um, planted um, my different uh, like a tomato plant two tomato plants and uh, some herbs and an eggplant stuff like that so let me turn here we still have some cleanup to do but it's come a long way let me back up Dutchie, what do you think of the rain? You love water, huh? You like it when it's cooler. Can't do your pool today because it's just wet and rainy. 
And then Jay brought me this peony for Mother's Day and it's blooming so pretty and some friends of ours actually brought me this um, it's a different kind of uh, lavender and it's so pretty it did uh, in our 80 degree weather it uh, kind of spent its flowers I was thinking do you guys know do I just trim it and it and it a reflower I don't know I'm gonna feed it too and our rose bush, the rose bush that Jay or Joshua, our son, bought me last year for Mother's Day, or was it the Mother's Day before that? <laughs> I think it might have been last year. That's about to bloom. It has a ton of little buds on it, ready to go. And Everything is looking good. We still have to do that pond and waterfall. There's just no time to do everything. Let me take you to the potager. Oh, also, our purple iris are blooming that smells so good. Oh, and I just walked right here. Check this out. Even though um, it hadn't rained yesterday, the grass was so thick from all the rain um, that it turned Jay's feet green, <laughs> his shoes, and it actually stained the concrete right here because it was so thick. So I'm going to try to step lightly over into the grass. And right bef in between rainstorms, I actually got some seeds planted. And last week, I it was last Sunday, I was trying to dig up the, the beds and put in new, um, new soil. And also this one right here, um, when we water it, it actually was putting the water into his shed because of where it landed on the cement slab of that. So I actually um, had, well, I tried to and then had Jay dig up the whole back of this and we put uh, some of that clear um, paneling or what is it that was on the greenhouse I don't know if you can see it there and we kind of um, made it kind of curve um, so that it, all the water wouldn't head that direction so we did that and I was trying to do it and then I got an allergy attack because the pollen was so bad last week so I'm kind of grateful for all this rain and my fountain I'm trying to get it all back set up but the ring broke so I was trying to dry it out but all the rain this broke off which that part sits on so we got to dry it out and glue that and then get it all back up but I got a lot of things planted um, we have Cucumbers right here going to go up the archway. That is an arch. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Um, hello. I'll, I'll come get you peanuts in a minute. Just a sec, okay? And I decided to put my mini pumpkins right here to go up the trellis. The grapevine is doing really good. Um, I've got cauliflower in there. Um, these baskets here are to keep the squirrels away from the seeds so they won't dig them up. And some herbs and some alyssum. All of these and including everything in here except for some of the tomatoes I grew in the greenhouse from seed. I'm so proud of myself because um, in years past my seedlings have not been that great. So I think the... Oh, <laughs> she's trying to get my attention. They're jumping. <laughs> They're jumping at me. <laughs> um, anyways, so proud of my seedlings here. Just, they look like real plants. <laughs> I'm so excited. And then this rose here, a mini rose that Jay got me, is going to bloom too. And we have a zucchini over here. I've got peppers in there, um, which I don't think they're going to like the cold weather. <laughs> Uh, this is parsley, Italian parsley, and um, I think I've got, I can't remember, peas right here. I've got carrots in there. Um, I just put all kinds of 
um, seeds all throughout it. So pretty happy with how this all came together, especially since I had to do it in between on my lunch hour between rainstorms. <laughs> so anyways, this is uh, Memorial Day weekend and it's just going to get better from here because we have three days. Well, I was going to say three days to do yard work, but um, with the rain, <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. <laughs> we'll talk to you in the next video. Bye. Okay, here's mom's grave. We've got one flag for dad and one flag each for, oh, there we go. One flag each for us kids and a pinwheel for each family group of um, grandkids. And what mom would call daisies, even though we know they're moms, she called all the pretty flowers like that daisies. And that's her favorite flower. And sweet Becca. <laughs> and we've got the flags flying and all around there are flowers on all the graves and it's only Friday so I bet this gets really packed this weekend. I have to come visit it a few times. Hello. <laughs> I was gonna say Cynthia. Becca. Ah, you did that young again. <laughs>